your own generation behind the meter doesn't touch the grid. It's you generating your own power in real time. And they now want to reach behind the meter and put a fee on those kilowatt hours. So uh, a big philosophical change to tax behind the meter self-generation. This is particularly <clears throat> troubling when you're talking about new load. If you add an EV and put up PV panels to, to meet the load, uh, then you're not reducing the amount of electricity you buy from the utilities. You're not failing to pay non-bypassable charges when you, on, on kilowatt hours that you used to pay them on. You're just, you're just generating your own power and not relying on the utility. And you're not having any grid impact. And so reaching behind the meter in the way that they propose would also tax this new load that is not utility load. It's just you generating power and using it entirely behind the meter. And so again, huge philosophical problem with them taxing behind the meter self-generation. Next slide. Here's the amounts we're talking about. For um, the NEM2 NBCs, you can see that first yellow line, two and a half cents, where we've become very familiar with the NBCs in NEM2, two cents, two and a half cents. Uh, it's your reduction and you know, it gets reduced from the value of NEM credit. And then there are a bunch of other NBCs that were not included in NEM2. Most of them are small. Uh, there is this new system generation charge at SCE is, is over one cent, so that's significant. Uh, for the other two IOUs, there's not much in this miscellaneous category currently. Although one that looks extremely troubling is the brand new NBC uh, with PGD, the wildfire hardening charge. So they're now charging a tenth of a cent per kilowatt hour for wildfire hardening. Of course, we're talking billions of dollars that they need to spend to make the grid more safe. You know, they're talking about spending $40 billion in undergrounding alone, plus the tree trimmings and everything else, plus, you know, coating the cables, batter cables, you know, lots more maintenance, tens of billions of dollars, and that could potentially be put into a new NBC. They just started, uh, and pg e with the wildfire hardening charge, putting it as NBC, so moving that over into the ones that, that NEM customers pay, um, would be it would be a big deal because there, there's no question it would grow over time. And then the power charge and difference adjustment, the PCIA, is designed mostly for CCA customers. The, the, the concept here is that uh, the, the utility signs.